isn't complete without a good pair of shades, but there are so many options from the frames, the color, sizes, and tints. We need some help, right? So here, with this summer's hottest sunglass trends, is People Style Watch staff editor Kristen Maxwell. Hello. And where do you even begin with sunglasses? Whoa. What's hot right now? We'll start with that. Okay. That's a good place to start. So we have our five trends laid out here. Our first one is coffee-colored frames. So these are going to be your tans and your browns. They're super versatile, super sophisticated choice for every day. We have our coach ones. They are, um, these are $183. And then we have our Converse Heritage, and these are $65.71. So we oh, kind of so have a big difference. Yeah, yeah, we have a kind of a higher end and then a more. You know, everybody expensive. gets afraid of buying the most expensive yes. sunglasses yes. because you sit on them, you lose them, they go off right. the boat. Right. But, you know, these aren't too bad these price points. Yeah, no, these are still good. So our next one is pastels. These are velvet. Um, they're $159. And then these are AJ Morgan. They're just $19.99. And this is a trend that we saw on the spring runways. They came into summer. Now they're onto shades. They're very vintage looking. Yeah, they are. And we've got color blocks. So kind of two trends in one. Yeah, very cute. Love it. Next we have neons. These are your electric shades. These are fresh. They're fun. They're great for summer, especially for the weekend. Especially when your outfit is so bright, you have to wear shades. It's, there you go. <laughs> there you go. That happens to me every once in a while. <laughs> we have Marc Jacobs. These, Marc by Marc Jacobs, they're $98. And then these are girl props, just $5.99. What? Yeah. $5? So, yeah. These are a must have. Okay, everyone, those are you're just leaving behind. Everyone go out and buy those. <laughs> then we have gray. Um, these are Ray Bans. So these are $199. These are Fanta's Eyes, just 20 bucks. These again are kind of a classic, like tortoise shell or black, yet they just kind of have that of the moment fresher feel. They sort of feel like John Lennon glasses, those. They absolutely do. They're, very They're cool. good for and face shape. We'll get to that. Oh, good, okay. And then we have our cat eye. This is definitely something we've seen before. Mm -hmm. It's a fave of the Hollywood A listers. Um, it's just fun, it's sexy, very feminine, and adds instant glam to any look. These are Dior, $295. Saw you had those on earlier. Mm -hmm. Great taste. And oh, then, thank you. <laughs> and then Lulu's, those are just $9. Oh, hello, yeah. Lulu. Now, okay, so we, we mentioned face shape. Yes. And there's nothing worse than buying a pair of really, but, especially exp expensive sunglasses, and then realizing that they were the wrong ones. Yes. Exactly. Because you were drunk or something and right. you picked out the wrong frame. So how do we know which kind of sunglasses we're well, supposed to wear? I'll take you through the face shapes. The first is oval. If you have an oval face shape, you're lucky. Your face is already balanced naturally, so you can rock any of these you shapes. You look like you might have an oval face. Are you lucky? That makes say. you better than the I rest of us? Say. Yes, okay, it's true. She's better than the rest of us. Next <laughs> is, um, well, I, you know, sometimes have a longer face. I would think I could fall into either of those. And that the oversized shades are great for that because they kind of cover more of your face. They're going to shorten it a bit and add a little bit of width. Oh. Again, we want to create that balance. Yeah. For a rounder face, maybe you. I you think might I'm be. Round, yeah. yeah. This is great because it's got the <laughs> angles on the frame. So it's going to emphasize your cheekbones. Let's see how those look. They look good. Very nice. Yeah, yeah. You feeling it? Actually, I really like these. <laughs> these are really good. We can talk after. All right. <laughs> and then we have the round frames. These are great for um, a more square face because the softer edges are going to just go ahead and soften the square forehead and a more angular jaw. And what about cat eyes? Who can wear those? Heart shaped, which I think you could fall either Somewhere way. Somewhere in the middle? Yeah, these you are guys great. be the judge. Let me know. What do you think? <laughs> these make me feel feisty. <laughs> yeah, right. I think that's the point. That's totally. the one. Yeah. Now, what would happen if someone like? Can I show you what not to do? I guess. Sure. Should I put which ones? Should I, think, I, put on? I think you need to go with those. These ones. Yeah. So if I put on the round ones in my round face. Maybe I won't look so cool. Yeah, you're right. I don't look I don't that know. cool. Well, you still kind of look cool. No, no, I think the other ones were better. What do you guys think? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Do you, you like these? No. Okay. You like the other ones? Yeah. All right, and okay, long face. I want right. to see you in the ones you're supposed to be these. wearing. Let's try these on. All right. Oh, oh look at how cool those are. Yeah. 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 That's really nice. Like and now, if I was to try those on, I don't know that it would work quite no. as well. <laughs> yeah, no, I sort of look like a grandmother or something. Yeah. Why are you showing him? Why is he the one that's like, come here, you wear these. Come here. Like a grandmother? Yeah, no, come here, wear these. Right, thank you so much yeah, for coming on. Thanks for having me. This is my son, as far as Adam Sandler is concerned. <laughs> yeah!
issue of People's Style Watch with Jessica Alba on the cover is on newsstands right now. Thank this you. was really fun. Thank yeah, you for coming. Great. Thanks for having and me. And I feel so very informed. Um, up next, we got Jim Shearer. He's got a live performance from Walk the Moon. But first, here's their video for Anna Sun.